I was bored one day, so I decided to scroll through my Steam library, and then that's when I saw that Stride VR, a game I'd played way back when it came out in 2020, had just recently received a multiplayer update. And I decided to give it a try, and, well... I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty fun. To those of you who don't know, Stride VR is a parkour free-running game, a little bit like Mirror's Edge. I've always been into parkour, and I really like this game because it can make me feel like I'm actually good at it. When this game first came out, it only had one game mode, Endless. This mode was fun, but it didn't offer much replayability, as you would just endlessly run in a straight path trying to get a new high score. I used to be like second up place on the leaderboard. Uh, it was fun, but not enough. And since then, three other game modes have actually been added. And built into multiplayer are two other game modes, Horde and King of the Hill. I'm just going to be talking about these multiplayer game modes because they interest me the most. Oh my god. Let's start with Horde mode, which is basically just a game of tag. One person starts off it, and then they have to go around tagging the other players, and everyone else gets it. Why am I explaining tag? I'm sure you already know how it works. Basically, it's tag. And it's fun, because there's parkour. Duh. There's honestly nothing more satisfying than running away from an entire lobby of people chasing you and outmaneuvering them using parkour. It's just something so satisfying about it. Oh, uh -oh. Hey, green man. Oh my god. Hey, my screen's going either way. <laughs> Oh, oh. oh my god, I missed. Where'd he go? I have to fix my life. No, I'm still winning. But of course, when it comes to VR, it's not just the game that's fun, but also the social aspect of the game. How do you do the thing? Oh! There, wait. There. Go <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, come on, I was figuring out the controls. Okay, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> and finally, the last multiplayer game mode, King of the Hill. I don't like this game mode as much as I like Horde. Don't get me wrong, I still really like King of the Hill. It's just I prefer Horde. I definitely say it's my least favorite because I'm not very good at it, so it's definitely just a skill issue. Uh, the game mode isn't really as the name would s describe, it's not King of the Hill, but it's more you have to tag the person who has the crown, and whoever has the crown the longest wins. The whole game mode is kind of just like the constant feeling of getting chased in horde mode, but b you don't always get chased, sometimes you're just the one chasing the entire game, like me, if you're bad. But this game mode can also lead to a lot of fun situations. All in all, I'd say that this multiplayer update was a really great addition to the game, and I can't wait to see what the devs have to add later in the future. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Uh, peace.